Hi guys, welcome back sa YouTube channel ko. So for today, magsolve tayo ng isang random math problem galing from algebra. So this is another word problem so relating to uh, work mga lodi. So mga rate problem to. So before that mga lodi, shoutout nga pala kay Max JV ng Cebu Technological University main campus. So he is currently uh, a BS Electronics, uh, Electrical Engineering. So fifth year na siya. So good luck sa lodi and konting ano na lang. Kunting kembot na lang, engineer ka na. So, I hope you are the best and be one of the best engineers uh, soonest. Okay, so ito yung problem mga Lodi. It will take 15 hours to fill a pool when two faucets are open. The first faucet is open, is kept open for the first 8 hours. After that, it will take the second faucet 50 hours more to fill the whole pool. Find the time it takes for the second faucet to fill the pool alone. Okay, so analyze natin mga Lodi. So, kapag yung dalawang faucet daw is nakabukas, they will take 15 hours to fill the pool. Alam naman natin na ang rate, mga Lodi, so recap lang tayo mga idol ha, ang rate that is equal to 1 over yung time natin. Kung mas mababa yung time, mas mabilis. Kung mas matagal yung time, mas mabagal. Okay? So, dun sa una natin uh, given, it will take 15 hours. So, let's say x yung time nung una time ng first faucet. So, time ni A, let's say. Let Y yung time ng pangalawa natin. Okay? So, alam natin na ang reciprocal ng time is yung rate. So, kailangan kasi in terms of this problem, rate yung uh, magiging atake natin. I mean, rate uh, approach. So, we will be relating the rates. Okay. So, 15 hours yung dalawa. So, it follows that our first equation will be 1 over X plus 1 over Y is equal to 1 over t. 1 over 15, sorry. Ayan. Kasi nga, di ba, rate ng una plus rate ng pangalawa equals yung rate nila na magkasama. So, this will be our first equation. Okay, doon tayo sa second equation. The first faucet is kept open for the first 8 hours. Ibig sabihin, siya yung unang nakabukas sa first 8 hours. Therefore, so, doon sa unang 8 hours na yun, ano yung magiging ano, implication sa equation natin? So, that will be 8 multiplied by 1 over uh, x. Kasi nga, 8 hours siya nakabukas. So, yung time, imumultiply natin dun sa rate niya. So, ibig sabihin, nakabukas lang siya sa unang walong oras. Pero, after nun, nakapatay na siya. Okay? So, ano to? Medyo kailangan mataas din yung comprehension natin sa English. Kasi, kapag meron tayong problema sa English, oh, medyo mahirap din mag-analyze. So, hindi lang, hindi naman laging totoo yung sinasabi nila na kapag magaling ka sa math, mahina ka sa English. Siguro kahit pa paano somehow average naman or even beyond above average. Okay? So, 8 times 1 over x, tas nakapatay na siya. After that, it will take the second faucet 50 hours more to fill the whole pool. So, that will be plus 50 multiplied by 1 over y. Kaya lang, Sir IJ, ano po yung ilalagay natin sa right side? Since, sa right side, since, since whole pool to mga lodi, tandaan natin that the complete job or complete work is equal to 1. Therefore, equate natin yun sa 1. So, if you have problems on that, so siguro try to practice more applications regarding sa work, sa rate, etc. Pero ito yung equation niya. 8, bakit 8? Kasi for 8 hours siya nakabukas, times 1 over x, plus 50, si second faucet na lang yung nagtrabaho after that. Multiplied by 1 over y equals 1. So, ano mangyari? So, simplify natin yung pangalawang equation. 8 over x plus 50 over y is equal to 1. And anong hinahanap natin? Find the time it takes for the second faucet. So that is yung y yung hinahanap natin. So we will try to eliminate x. So diba ito ang coefficient ito is 1, ito 8. So multiply natin to both sides by 8. Mga lods. So that is 8 over x. Ito yung mga lodi ah. Baka nalito po. Plus 8 over y is equal to 1 over 15 times 8. 8 over 15. Bakit ko tinayin sa 8? Kasi 8 po yung coefficient ng second equation natin. So, ito po yung second equation, mga Lodi, ah. Our second equation. Okay? So, ano na mangyari dyan, Sir IJ? Di ba we want to solve for the value of y? So, eliminate natin, i-minus natin yan. So, this will become 50 over y minus 8 over y. That is 42 over y is equal to 1 minus 8 over 15. That is 7 over 15. So, solving for y, ang quickest way dyan, 42 divided by 7, that is 6 times 15, 
Therefore, the correct answer for this problem is 90 hours. So, kung gusto nyo isolve yung x, pwede naman eliminate nyo yung y. Ganun lang siya. Pero huwag nyo nang isimplify ito mga lodi kasi in solving such type of equations, dapat nakaganito lang siya tapos you do some elimination by multiplying a certain equation by a constant. Okay? So, kung meron kayong questions or clarifications mga lodi, huwag kayong maya mag-comment sa comment section. Thank you so much sa patuloy na pag-support and sa pag-subscribe sa channel natin. More power sa inyo mga lodi and keep safe na lang and see you on my next match tutorial video and bye-bye!